Howdy TPDL fans and happy What Wednesday. Are you ready to get down with today's topic? I have recruited Hannah to help me out with this week's what question. Yes, I have been tasked to answer the question, what is Downey Motorhome? So how about these crazy weather conditions? It has been wet, windy, and cold all day. One may say that these conditions are pretty ideal for downy mildew development. What do you think? Almost so. Today is actually probably too cold for downy mildew, but they do prefer conditions that are cool, wet, and high humidity, around 50 to 70 degrees Fahrenheit. Okay. But downy mildew is probably spread easily in these conditions via water and wind. Oh, tell me more, girl. Downy mildew is caused by several different genera of Oomycetes, but the more common two that infect ornamentals belong to either the genus Paranospora or Plasmapara. The species will depend on the host. Symptoms can vary by host, but the most common are vein-bound chlorosis on the upper leaf surface, followed by white, bluish-gray to black, fuzzy, fluffy sporulation or growth on the underside of the leaf. Think of down under in correlation to downy. These are microscopic images of Paranospora belbari, causal agent for basal downy mildew. So, how can you prevent or manage downy mildew? You can be preventative by providing good air circulation to your plants. Avoid watering in the evening. <laughs> Avoid prolonged leaf wetness. If it is a severe infection, you will need to remove and destroy the plants. Well, thank you, Hannah, for all that great information, and I hope you all enjoyed it at home. Hope you guys stay dry out there. And keep your plants dry, too.